Hey everyone, welcome back to another Monday Motivation. Hope you're going really well. A really tactical, practical tip today for those that aren't using LinkedIn to the full extent to drive sales, increase conversion ratio, or prospect to fill your pipeline, you're missing out massively. Uh, as you know, you may even be seeing this right now on LinkedIn. I've been quite bullish on LinkedIn for the last couple of years, actively using it to grow my audience and produce content, but more specifically, use it in the sales cycle. So I wanna give you a couple of my top tips to help you use LinkedIn for your sales results. So tip number one, if you've currently got a hot deal that you're trying to close, use that as a thought starter to produce one piece of content you know is going to help. I'll give you an example. Let's say you're a project related company, uh, you've got a, you, you, you fulfilling a part, portion of an overall project, your client is on the fence about to do business, but you feel like they're a little bit hesitant in regards to your capability to, do, to deliver. So what's the strategy? Well, we need to de-risk. We need to de-risk ourselves in association with them because that will get us the order. So what you need to do is firstly connect with as many people in the organization that you're trying to close, trying to convert. That's step number one. Step number two is produce a single piece of content that you share to the broader world, whether it's video or a photo um, with associated text, answering that one problem that you know that's on their mind. So in this case, you might put together a social proof post, a case study of a previous project that you've done that looks very similar or has very similar capabilities or scope as the one you're trying to close. Guess what? There's a good chance if you're connected with that audience and they're scrolling through their feed, which everyone does, and boom, they see a piece of content that's talking about, hey, here's a previous project that we've done. This was the challenge. This was the solution we came up with and this was the outcome. That might be enough for them to go, hmm, maybe they can deliver. And that can be the difference, the one percenter of you winning or losing the deal. So that's tip number one, produce single pieces of content to your audience with one person in mind solving one problem in your sales process. Tip number two is when you're doing lots of face-to-face -face meetings and face-to-face -face visits with your client, ensure that you send them a text straight after you've met with them, okay, using your phone. Send them a text message so you've got their direct contact details, but also send them a LinkedIn message thanking them for their time and also casting forward the next steps. I know personally and some of my students personally have closed their biggest deals through LinkedIn message as a follow-up. Okay, so typically when we're doing follow-ups, all we're thinking about is phone calls, voicemails, face-to-face -face visits, uh, email, like text messages, but a LinkedIn message is a great one to do it as well. And then the third little tip that I wanna uh, put, put out there for you is get in the habit of being creative. I think there's a future world where it's not just the company page, excuse me, the phone's always going, not just the company page, but also an opportunity for you as a B2B salesperson to build your own personal brand in alignment to the company page. So if you're, if you're a marketer right now, you're working for your company and you're producing content on your company page, brilliant, but also empower your sales team to produce their own content too, because the combination of both of them are working really, really well. So there's a couple of tips for you of how you can bring LinkedIn into your world. I could talk about it all day. In fact, I've put together a complete LinkedIn sales machine online training program that walks you through step by step, video after video. Super easy to implement, really simple walkthrough tutorials with PDF downloaders, downloads and checklists. If you're keen uh, and want to enroll in the program, I think, how much is it? 297 bucks? That's it. 297 bucks. Cheapest chips to help you get your pipeline full and close real deals on LinkedIn. Click through on the link below if you wanna check that out. But if not, hope you've enjoyed those couple of tips. Go ahead and implement, because that's where the value is. It's in the implementation, not so much the knowledge. So, hope that helps. A Little bit of a longer one. Thanks for watching. We'll see you on the next Monday Motivation really soon.